everybody and welcome back to my channel. So this is just my little intro I'm gonna be filming right now because my shiny Atlantis albums and my shiny washi tapes are on the way. They're like with the courier so they'll be here today so I thought I'd film this intro while I still have daylight and then I will film the unboxing parts as soon as those arrive. I'm so excited. I ordered three copies of Shiny's Atlantis and then my Don't Call Me inspired washi tapes. I got made with Ali, uh, manufacturer in Alibaba and so those are gonna arrive today. I'm like incredibly excited to see what those look like because I saw the picture of like the production like when it was finished, but it's different like seeing it and holding it in your own hands. So I'm super excited about those and being able to put those up on my shop. I also ordered business cards today and little tiny um, like prints, I guess postcard prints of this art. It's just my shiny five art. Um, and that's gonna go with the washi tapes. If you order like the set of the two of them, you'll also get that little mini print in there too. So that's super exciting. I feel like I'm leveling up the business side of things and just kind of making it better. Cause the business cards I've been using have been really crappy ones that I like made on some like free business card builder on the internet and then I would print them out myself. But I like these a lot better and I think that they'll look a lot nicer. So as soon as the courier arrives with my packages, I will cut to that unboxing portion of it. And then you guys can see along with me who I got and what the albums look like, washi tape looks like. It's a very exciting unboxing day. Okay, so they have arrived. Uh, this is my box for my washi tape and then the box for the um, CDs is just over there. But I think I'm gonna open the washi tape first. It's a pretty big, box it's not terribly heavy but i mean there's only a hundred um pieces of washi tape in here i hope this lighting is like okay at least or this angle because i don't the tripod that i have doesn't really like angle down so i can't do like down top down shots or anything i'm gonna have to work on that <laughs> It's fine, we're fine. Can you see them? Look, <gasps> this is so exciting. I've never had this before. Wowie, okay, okay. So you can see on the top that this is the, uh, here, no, let's see. I'll do close up shots probably somewhere else, but this is the fake reality. Um, version. Oh my goodness. Wow. That's so exciting. So yeah, so all of these are those and then the reality version. Which again, I will probably have to, let's see, can I hit? Well, I'll take them out of the plastic in a moment, but that's what that one looks like. Wow, that's so exciting. Okay. Oh, I keep knocking. I have this like leaned up against a chair. It's a very precarious situation. Okay, so I'll take one of each and I'll open them and we will look together. I'm very, very excited. So now I think I'm going to switch the camera. And I'm just going to hold it while I do it. Actually, first I will open up one of each that I will keep as my own. Okay, this zipper seal thing. I did ask, try to ask if I could get it without the plastic, but I don't think that came across, obviously, because they were wrapped in plastic. So I'll definitely try that for next time if I ever do washi tape again. Because I don't really need them to be wrapped up. Like, it, it's not that important. Sorry, I don't even know if this is in the frame. Okay, switching camera now. So these are the two. So this is the fake reality. It says, you know, sorry, the number you have called has been disconnected with a rose from Minho's thing. And then I did sort of my like red slash greenish version of the logo for that which is sort of Don't Call Me inspired. And then the feathers was based on Key's um, head wrap thing. So there's that, so cute. And then for the reality version, 
We have lots of different things. We have the car, like the old timey car from the teaser and then a UFO, obviously. And then the, there is a fish on a uh, fishing rod uh, in front of a cup, like from what Key was holding. And then the um, telephone box, I think it's actually that way, the telephone box from the teasers again as well. And I put it on like that sort of very like blue background. Okay, now I'm gonna take a little piece off and show you what it looks like just out. Okay, so that is what the two look like. I am so impressed at how like crisp, sorry, I'm so shaky, but on how like crisp it looks. I was worried that they would be like grainy, but they're totally not. They look so good. Oh my goodness. Ah! So yeah, so these are going to be up for sale very, very soon in my shop on my Etsy, the link's always down below. Um, I'm gonna include, have the set be with these two plus a little shiny print, so I'm just waiting for those to come in. And then these will be up for sale, look at them. Oh my God, I'm so happy, like I'm very, very impressed. And they're good sized like rolls too, like that's quite a bit of washi tape, you know? Like they're, you're definitely not getting like just a little bit of tape, which I know some washi tapes are like that, but I'm super impressed with these. Oh, so now I got so many tapes, all the tapes forever. Okay, so now I will open my shiny albums, which are right there. I decided to try and change up the angle again because I'm my tripod is not very good, so I'm trying a different angle where I will show you just with me, and then I will check all the footage, and then if I have to do like kind of, I'll do close-up shots, sort of at the end, just like going over everything. But this is what the box looks like. There should be three copies in here. And I don't believe I got any posters because generally I just, I I don't want to, like I don't, I don't care about posters. I don't want to pay for them, so. And I have all three posters from Don't Call Me. So I definitely didn't need more posters. <laughs> and I always keep all the boxes and all the bubble wrap because I use that stuff all the time. I don't know if you'll be able to see it, but kind of look up in the my closet. There is, that's where I keep all of my packing supplies and I would never have to buy bubble wrap which is awesome because I just keep it all. And then I just use whatever bits and pieces because who cares if the bubble wrap is looks nice or not. So yeah. And these are just as like what I thought. They're the same size as the Don't Call Me albums. Let's see. Oh, for a minute I thought they gave me three of the same version and I was like, no, they didn't. We're fine. We're fine. <laughs> so these are the two versions. I don't remember which, what's which one, but there is this one. And there is this one. Both super cute. I really like the um, sort of like the holographic text for Atlantis, that's super cute. And then both have this on the back. And are they the same? Oh no, and then this one is just, yeah, it's the same, but it's um, like teal, I guess, instead of uh, brown. But yeah, and then I got two, this, the, for the third copy, I got two of this cover. Yeah, so now let's get these open. Okay, so third camera change for this video. Sorry about that. I'm just really trying to figure out different ways. Right now I have it leaning up against my chair and hopefully, and I'm sitting on the floor, so hopefully this works well because I realized that in those other clips, the glare was really bad, but hopefully this is a little better. So yeah, so again, these are the two versions and then I got two of this version and I can't remember which version is which. So, oh well, let's get one of these open. Ooh, I love it when I'm just able to slice the top and then I can just like so nicely slide the plastic off. That's so good. And then, so there is the sticker. It says the seventh album repackage, Atlantis Shiny with like the compass. Uh, there we go. So yeah, so that's the sticker. The sticker looks to be the same on both versions, but there it is. And so, yeah, so we will go ahead and open this one first. I'll move these out of the way. So yeah, so there is 
the front again with the holographic Atlantis and then this down here is holographic as well and then we have the side which oops ah, it's fine everything's falling out side doesn't have anything on the spine which is a little weird it's like just glued there's nothing on the spine so this album will definitely be crappy to, to display like this because then you can't tell what it is like there's no cool design but then there is this for the back I do like this color and then all of the um the track list on the back is also in that holographic feel and then yeah and then I believe yeah then this is the envelope that this one comes in so it has this sticker which I may have to go and take off out of camera because I've, if it's anything like the don't call me stickers then it'll suck to get on or to get to take off but then it says Atlantis and has some stamps and then it looks so it looks like a little letter I do really like this I like this envelope more than the don't call me one just because it looks like a little letter so then they're there and then that's the track list that's super cool looks like the letter and then says Atlantis and again has just like the little stamps from Atlantis that's super cute I love that okay so we'll look at that in a moment first we'll just do the photo book so and you'll see everything I'm looking at everything upside down because of just the way I have to have everything set up but that's cool it looks like a little taped like um, Polaroid but it's not it's just a part this album feels because there's no spine feels incredibly flimsy like it actually doesn't feel like it's going to stay together at all which makes me very worried oh my god yeah like it feels like just opening these pages feels like there's only a thin layer of glue and they're just gonna it's literally just gonna like unfurl which is very stressful but I'll just be very careful Ooh, this album's so pretty I love the aesthetic of this album like a ah oh, so cute I love it uh, Ooh, they look so good. Look at them. I just want to like smoosh all of their cheeks. Just smoosh them. Oh, they're so cute. Then they have the lyrics to Atlantis. Ooh, lyrics to Code. The missing, <laughs> the missing fish. With the little fish, that's so cute. Oh, and I love how they paint some of them. I don't know if all the members did, but at least some of the members painted their nails with pearl aqua. That's super cute. And then the fix. Oh my god, what the hell is that? Is that an octopus with socks on? That's so funny. I love that. I love him. And then, oh, going back to Don't Call Me. figures there's the lyrics to don't call me and then the lyrics to area I'm so proud of Min Ho he wrote those lyrics love him heart attack Ooh, I want to just smoosh him god he's so cute I just don't understand oh this is cool kind of all like the artifacts it's like almost like a weird like textbook I really like this and well, I guess while we're going through this, I'm sure a lot of you have heard that Taemin just announced that he's going to be going to the military on uh, May 31st. And like, I watched his live stream and like, I'm not sad that he's going to the military. Like, I'm like, you might as well take advantage of going kind of earlier while we're in COVID. Like, we can't have in-person concerts anyway. And like, the other three members are back. Like, and it's only like, you know, he'll be back before the end of 2022. Like, we've done it before. We can do it again. But I was, I'm so sad that he's sad like he's not an emotional person like he's never really been an emotional person and like you can almost count on your hand how many times he's cried but he's he was like crying on his v live because he was leaving like that's what made me sad is that he's sad but it looks like people are speculating he's going to be joining the military band like he did which hopefully which i feel like is a good place for him and he looked like he had a great time so hopefully Taemin will be the same but like i'm just i'm sad that He's sad and he's worried about fans leaving and stuff, even though they have like so many, they have more fans than they've had like in a long time. Like, cause ah, like, don't worry about it, Taemin, you'll be okay. These outfits are pretty. But oh, I'm like, that's so 
sad. Oh, I like this collar thing on Key, but I was very sad for him that he was so sad. But I'm not sad that he's leaving. So hopefully that makes sense. He looks kind of short. He looks like he's doing that TikTok trend where you raise your hands up and like look down at the camera when it's like on the floor. That's funny. And then they're on the ship with Kind. And then the credits. And then the back. And the texture of the paper is like the, these, these are just like thick pieces of like cardstock. But this has like a soft touch kind of feel. Like it's kind of, it's like soft to touch, which I really like. Okay, and then we will open the second one, the other version up first, and then we'll look at the photo cards. Okay, so that one was way more of a struggle to get off the plastic, but we did it. The sticker is the same, but this has, again, the soft touch feel with the holographic Atlantis and Shiny the Seventh album. And again, has the no spine, which makes it feel very flimsy. And then this is the same. You can kind of, wait, can I get it? Yeah, kind of like that. You can see that the, the track list is the holographic feel again, and this is the same background, it's just brown instead. And then for the thing, these might be the same, are they? Yes, so these are the same, so I'll spend a little less time on this. But yeah, so this envelope is the same. The same color sticker and everything, they are the same. And then we'll move on to this photo book. Okay, cute. So it's kind of the same sort of thing where it looks like a Polaroid, but is not. And then that is the same. I actually don't know if these are the same um, uh, the photos. Oh, they might be. They might be. So we'll go through. Let's actually see. Oh, no, they are um, not. They are not. They just looked the same, but the, the, they have the same concept, so that's fair. Look, see, when he even did his nails too, I love it. Oh, they look so good in this comeback. I love it. Like, this is definitely, I know I said it in my um, reaction to the music video, this is definitely a more shiny comeback than Don't Call Me was. But that's why I like Don't Call Me, is because it was sort of unexpected. Like, this is definitely an expected shiny release, which means it's phenomenal but don't call me was so different which i loved like i was so i was happy that they were trying something new and they succeeded and they did very well and it there's a little cactus and then ooh -hoo. such close up i like that these are actually full images because sm has a notorious habit of doing like the just like having a whole white page but then having just the picture in the middle so i like that these are full page like um pictures because it, it just feels like so much more full so i really like that oh so cute. <laughs> That's funny. I like that picture. Because yes, this is all blank, but I, they do it. It's a creative enough picture that like it, that's okay. But yeah, ooh, this looks so good. I love his blonde hair. I'm so happy he was blonde for this. We, this is the best Minho hair. I like all his hair. I'll be clear, but I'm happy that we got a Minho blonde thing. Because for one, one of one, we just had it for such a short amount of time. Same with this, I guess, two boys. We got a full music video and we had, he had red hair. It was very exciting. And then they're lying on the ocean, I guess. <laughs> Woohoo. Love him, look at that. And then a lot of the looking up pictures. That's okay. Him in in the water. He's doing his classic, like, all he needs to do is put his arms out a little for, and then that would be his classic arms out stance. And then the credits with this pattern. I like this pattern, too. It's very, like, acid trippy. But yes, so that is the photo books for these two albums. Now I'm going to open up the third one just to get the envelope out and open the stickers, and then I'll come back here to do the photo cards. Okay, I was able to get these stickers off with not that much problem. I did um, use a hairdryer to loosen them, but they were definitely easier to remove than the Don't Call Me stickers. Okay, now I'm just gonna empty them and hope that I don't spoil myself because it's more fun not to spoil yourself. <laughs> so that's it for that one.
Okay, so here are all three. Now I do collect, oh, this is upside down. Okay, so I just emptied out all of the things and I'm totally a fool. I could have definitely had this the right way around for me instead of me being upside down. Cause like, yeah, the camera's fa facing this way, but you can change around the camera. I'm such a fool. I'm so sorry that that was so annoying, but we're right way around this time. Oh my goodness. Okay. So we will start with, um, I guess this pile here. I can't remember which pile came from which, so, but I guess there's no specific version. So we have this. Oh my God, it's got came in. Ah! Oh my God, I love this picture. How cute is he? Look at him. Ah. And there's little flowers. Oh. These are so cute. Oh my goodness. Okay, so this is Taemin's. I collect OT5 for shiny, just in case you guys did not know. And then at the back, it's this little sailing log. That's cute. That's cute. Oh my goodness. Okay. All right. Off to a good start. Are we good? And then these stickers. Ooh, these have a real, these are soft as well. Kind of like the cover. These are like soft touch stickers. So we'll just do a little zoomy zoomy. They're like stamp sized for some of them. That's super cool. I like that to go with the sailing theme. And then those two. And then the boys. Love these. Okay. Yes, yeah, so and there's that. I'll stick that here, I guess, for now. Okay. And. Okay. Oh, yeah. And these are the. Uh, I don't know what the hell they call these stickers, but, or these uh, photo cards, but you can like pop them out like they're perforated. But yeah, so then they look like that. I do like the way that these look, these are cute. But how, but I'm like, why would you make them, why wouldn't you just pop them out? Why do you have to make me do that? I mean, I don't want to do that. Ah, I think I might anyway, but then this is what the back looks like. Yeah, so that's these. And then the um the ad as SM always has. You know, pretty standard SM SM ad. It's just the that guy. I have so many of these from every album. Oh, let's can stick that there. Okay. Eh. Eh. Okay, we'll hide the CD, we'll hide the photo card. I think this is the CD, which I only now realize is not attached to the album. But oh my gosh, this CD is so pretty. This is probably one of their prettiest, like physical, like actual CDs. Like I actually want to like display this CD. Like I might actually frame it because it's so pretty. Like look at it. Ugh. Ah, so pretty. Okay. And then it comes in this envelope which again, just sort of has that very like with the stamps and stuff. So we'll put that very carefully back in. Okay, and then for the photo card, I haven't even looked at it yet. <laughs> Three, two, one. I got on you, oh my gosh, I love this card. This is actually one of my favorite cards. I know he posted it on Instagram, but like, come on, look at him. He's surfing on the little uh, crocodile. I love this card. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Okay. All right. And then there's his back. I like these backs too. They're very cute. Oh my goodness. Okay. Oh, I'm so excited. I love him. Ah, okay. All right. So there is the first one. And then we'll just move right on into the second. Okay, so now this will be the postcard. I'm Again, I would like to not get Tame In again just because I collect OT5, but if I do, then I'll trade. It'll be fine. Huh. Key! Oh, look at his little hat. I love this card. Ooh, I like his earring. That's a cute earring. I like these postcards. They're big too. They're kind of bigger than I expected them to be, which is, but they're nice. Like they're, but I don't know if they'll actually fit in like two pocket sleeves. But we'll see. I don't actually even have any of those right now, so can't put them in my binder anyway, but super cute. Oh, I love it. He's so beautiful. I can't help it. Okay. 
and then the back is the same. So I'll just put that there. And then these stickers, this is, oh, okay, this is the other set. Again, they're like the soft feeling. So then the top, and then these ones, these are cute. I'll never use them. Bella, please. My dog's like coming in. Don't mess up my setup. And then these. Oh, I'll never be able to use these stickers. Thank you for giving me stickers, but I'll never be able to use them. There, you could see her there. That was my Bella. And then, oh, there's a photo card. Hey, okay, I'll hide it. I'll hide it. I'll hide it. Okay, so then, yeah, this is just the ad. Again, it's probably the same. And then these are the other version of the um, pop-out cards. I like this color. It's very shiny. Ha ha ha. These are cute. These are cute. Oh, see, he has the cute. Oh, I love his little outfit. Oh, so cute. And then again, the back, I think it's, I think it's the same. It's just in the different color. Okay, so then we'll stick that under there. Okay, and then, oh, and then the CD, we'll see, is the CD the same? Yes, so the CD is the same for both versions. Very pretty. Okay, there we go. Especially with how flimsy these albums are, I actually like that the CD is separate, because then if you wanted to play the CD, you don't have to like open and close the album and like destroy yourself. Okay, so now we will try again for the photo cards again. If I get duplicates, it's fine because I'll just trade for them. But, you know, it's always nice to if you can just not get duplicates. So far, I'm good for the postcards, so that's exciting. Three, two, one. Oh, okay, it's the same own you card. He's just loving me this comeback, and I am not even that mad about it. Because, come on. Come on! It's so cute! Ugh, okay. All right, so cute. Oh my goodness. Okay, one more. Okay, this time I've moved the photo card away so we don't have to worry about getting spoiled. So now we just have to see with this. Again, I hope I get somebody that isn't Kierman a tame in, but I will trade. And I don't care. Okay, so I got key again. That is okay. Again, super cute. And I will just trade. So this one will be, of course, up for trade for Onyu or Minho. Which is weird. Normally I'm Minho curse and I get everything Minho. So it's weird that I haven't gotten him. <laughs> But then we have key, super cute. And then, uh, yeah, this will go a little faster because these will be the same. I do like that at least you get all four of these so you don't have to worry about those, but that will just, I'll put that on the side. These stickers again are from that version. And then the uh, CD will be the same. And then the ads are the same for all of the versions. Okay, so now it's up to the photo card. Let's see, will I go three for three? Let's see. Okay, three, two, one. Oh, it's Key! Yay! Oh my goodness, I love him. Look at how cute he is. He definitely has this classic selfie angle. I'm like not putting it in frame at all because I'm so excited. Oh my goodness, look at him. Oh, he's so pretty. Oh my goodness. He's like flawless, I don't understand. Like you're older than me, sir. S sir, excuse me. You're so cute, like, uh, oh my goodness. Then there's his um, back. I love his signature too, it's like so flowy. I love it. Ugh, okay, I will rearrange this just so we can get a quick, over quick overview of all of these um, inclusions. Okay, so I've just laid everything out. I just put one of everything just to save on space, but this is all the inclusions that I got, including both versions, the ad, CD, photo cards, stickers, pop-out photo card things, and postcards. I love this concept. I'm so, so, so happy. Oh my goodness, I actually might want to buy more albums just because it's so pretty. Uh, so like, but like I had said previously, I will be trading my extra key postcard for either Onyu or Minho. And I will be trading my extra Onyu photo card for any of the other photo cards except for this one and this one. Um, so if you have any of those photo cards you want to trade, please DM me on Instagram. That'll be the easiest. Otherwise, I will 
keep you guys updated on my search for the photo cards. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed this little quick unboxing thing here. Uh, please again subscribe if you haven't and you would like to and leave a like on this video if you like this style of video and also leave a comment on what your favorite song in Atlantis is now that we have the full package of Don't Call Me and Atlantis. It has Atlantis or any of the three other songs, the two other songs taken Don't Call Me's place. Let me know. See you guys next time. Bye!